Okay, friends, it's November the 1st, 2018. World dumping U.S. debt and hoarding gold de-dollarized and explained. Okay, RT. I'll leave a link to this one here. All right. And here's another one that you need to listen to. If you This is from Florida. Uh, Marquise. One, one, 18. Battering, bartering now criminalized by the government. Do you, what's this? How do you prepare for this? In other words, they're demanding that Venezuela is bartering using gold to buy goods from other countries. In fact, they're buying from Turkey. What Trump is doing with his gang of idiots is putting our country in jeopardy and, and we're going to be financially broke if they do not go back to gold and silver standard and dump the uh, the phony dollar. We will be in the same shape as Venezuela. We won't be able to barter. They'll demand that we show proof of everything that we buy, sell, and trade for. Okay, so this is coming. So you guys that believe Trump is a hero, uh, that's why he's going to attack Venezuela. The word is on the street that that's the move. They're moving tanks down that way. They got ships off the bay there, off of South America, along with China and Russia. China and Russia is going to back Venezuela so they don't get attacked. I mean, this is getting crazy, guys. I mean, if we attack Venezuela, we're going to be attacked. All right. But they're wanting to take out Venezuela just like they did all the Arabic countries that did not play along well with America. So if you people don't understand this, you better wake up. I'll leave both of these links so you get updated on what world we're in and who's playing who for the fool. We are the fools. We're getting played. They're going to de, they're going to, they're going to put it so our money ain't worth nothing and we ain't going to be able to buy, trade, or sell with a, with a whole wheelbarrow of this stupid money. Okay? And they're hustling all they can. They figure they got to start a war with somebody to do it, but they can't do it because these people that I'm talking about, these countries, are no longer able to be compromised by America and the people with these world banks. They used to compromise both sides of the war to, to uh, you know, to keep the war going. It's not going to happen anymore. So watch and see how this unfolds. Talk to you later, the old Marine One, on November 1st, 2018. Bye-bye, friends.